I'm going to find the most bargains. I am finding the bargains. No, I am. No, no, no I am. I'm no, find the I am doing it today. Right, it's on. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to rumble! And here he is. Ian, masterpieces. And we're going to be off hunting, so what are you aiming looking for? I haven't had much luck recently. Past couple of weeks I've not found too much, so I'll take anything today. But you know us, toys, retro games, stuff for the collection, stuff to sell. Who knows? Yeah, let's go hunting. Here we are, round one, Ton Rebel. Round one. Here we are, we have the first one. Look at him, he's so eager. Oh, look at them. Pikachu slippers. They're cool. You are Ian. Ian. First find. Pokemon find of the day. Which are the, the slippers? Right. Um, kids. Pound. Pound. That's great. Thank you very much. It's mainly costume jewelry. Nice bits, though. Alright then, let's classify as round two then. Loads of jewelry as well. Go through some of these. Oh, well, that's quite nice. Wait, hang on. Oh, no, not again. Guys, I found gold again. It's nine carat gold. Yeah, Pick this necklace up as well for one minute. I'm just going two little bits. Oh, a pound each. Yep, yeah, that's great. Thank you very much. Still going to rummage around. Hello, follow me. Oh, that would have been nice if the guitar was in there. How are these up against you, though? Know? They're literally up to your waist. I don't think they would be my size here. Right, I don't know. Coast to coast rally. That's cool. Looks like a, looks like a trench coat. Give them boots. How do you put the bed in? Can't believe that. Another gold day. <laughs> You've been in there a few times and you've come out with gold a few times from that shop. I literally thought, as soon as they took it out the back, I was thinking, nah, they've gonna, they probably saw the markings and that was my day done. Yeah, yeah. Two pound, uh, no, okay, a pound Poundy, each. Pound, pound, a pound for that one. And it's probably, it's got quite a bit of weight to it, it's probably the easiest. Just shy of a hundred pound, probably. Reckon? Yeah, Whoa. Great little fight then, great start to the day. I'm on the winning score. Oh, here we are. <laughs> three. Here we are, round three. Come on, Ian. Sorry. Look at the size of our grommet. It doesn't exactly live and he's in bed by half past eight. It's cold. Pineapple. Oh, it is vintage. 1984. Oh, I picked that up. That's quite cool. Hey, that'd be good for you, Ian. You got the teeth like Wallace. <laughs> oh, I got nice teeth. Oh, apart from that. Go through and see these guys, you never know what. Uh, sometimes you do find the PS1 games tucked in. That's weird, a pink Scooby Doo. <laughs> that is unusual, I've never seen a pink Scooby Doo before. Oh, I'll still pick him up. He's quite cool. <coughs> I'm a hungry hippos later. Yeah, I'll give you a game of that later. <laughs> right, I've got them three 
soft toys. Yeah. 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 I'll give them £2 for them as well. Well, there you are, guys. I had all them bits for £2. She did say £1, but I said, no, I'll give you £2. I'm more than happy to give you a little extra. So, yeah, we had all them bits for £2. So, we're making our way down to the animal, which is round four now, isn't it? Round four. Yep. Animal win. You always do really well in this animal win. I'm not confident. Not confident here. So, before we head on to the uh, the animal one, we've got some eBay sales. Let me show what's sold. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a wonderful sale. We just sold the Pikachu case for not much. $9.99 free the postage. Well, guys, we're back again. We sold two of these vintage uh, Grand Slam uh, whale uh, glass pint steins. Uh, I had them up for about, I think it was like $24.99. An offer came through, £15 plus the postage. Definitely had to shift them. Right guys, we've had some more eBay sales come through. We've sold another one of these uh, mascots. Uh, this kangaroo one has gone for £10 uh, plus the postage. Let's come over here. We've had a big sale. Where is he? Ah, from the car boot sale. We sold the Furby. And he's fully working. For £45, free the postage. So there you have it guys, after all the uh, postage and ebay fees, we made a grand total of £62.27. So we managed to cover the cost of everything I picked up from Tonopandi and Penna Grey. Especially that jelly cat bat, I know someone's interested in, uh, into it, so that will probably go very quick. Oh, I've also forgot to say as well, uh, I've managed to reduce the costs of the Blastoise cards we had from the Card of Card show, uh, and Screw It card. So we reduced it from what we paid to this so we get in there very slowly uh, happy days here we are round four let's go for it any new dvds cds no so look cheers thank you Oh, some PS games. Sonic Colors. Oh, look at these now. I'm going to give a £2 each on these games, guys. I know that one trades in for about £2. I think that trades in for about a fiver. I think that trades in for a couple of quid. And that one, not so much, but I'm on the happy to give it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pounds for all these four games. So, well, that's quite a. Cool lump shade. Cool. Soft toys. Let's have a look. Oh, cockatoo. Never seen a plush of a cockatoo before. Jemima plush. I'm gonna pick that for someone I know that is a big collector on Jemima puddle deck, so that's a little freebie for her. Oh, I'm surprised Ian didn't see that. British Lions. <laughs> I'll leave it on the window for him. Yeah, the seven pound on the counter for them games for you. Yeah. Wow, the fact. Uh, yeah. Didn't see him. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Pokemon things. How much for the little figure? Oh, you sure? Oh, no, I'll give you 50 pounds for it. So there we are, we had all them bits for 750. And what do you want? That's fine. A little bit of Spinosaurus and a rescue bot for the collection. That and was she, a pound. She was said 50 pence, but she said, oh, I don't know. But yeah, I uh, gave them all for them games because it's easily a couple of quid's worth of trading once they're free. Here we are, round five. Round five already? Yep. Yeah! 
Let's go for it. Let me see if there's anything new. No, I don't think, don't think there is. I always come and have a look, see if there's any new things like games or what's that brand new see. London Welsh Festival and Mail Choir. Yeah. Ian, I think you look lovely in that. Huh? That red red and hood dress. You would look stunning in that. You know, make a decent bundle. I'm gonna see how many I can find. But there we are, guys. We got a total of 26 figures. So that's £2.60, but I also spotted this bad boy, this, the Avengers car, so that's £2.70. Oh, just found one of the horses to go with them play my wheels, but I still paid £10 for that, that's not bad. So far we're at uh, £2.80. Well anyway guys, I had 28 figures, so that was £2.80, bargain. Here we are in Tolapandi, round 6 now guys. Mastering manga. Seems all brand new. Yeah, pick that up for fifty pence. It's a wacky mug. It's modern. Looks like ET. Guys, big Paw Patrol vehicles. We've got the fire truck, the Paw Patrol vehicle. I don't know what it's actually called. And this big bad boy. Well, I found one thing in there that Pokemon book for 50p. And he has lost that round. Nothing. For absolutely nothing. So now it's round seven now for Are the you next one. That as a win. You literally bought a Pokemon for 50p. Well, and you're claiming that as a win. Well, it's still a count, isn't it? <laughs> Here we are, guys. Round seven. Right, I'm gonna go in there see if they've got any new games in. New games? <gasps> GameCube. That's what I want to see. Fourteen ninety nine. I'll have to look at that. <gasps> Another one. What's that one? Fourteen ninety nine. Fifty pound each. Oh, I used to love Quack Attack. Any more game cubes? Quake 3. Oh, cheeky little devil. <laughs> well, that was a bust for me. He had a win. Look at this. Pair of Adidas Predators. Demon scale, laceless. They're only seven quid. That is a steal. But uh, them GameCube games, they were way overpriced. They weren't even with... Because I know sometimes the GameCube games, uh, the discs are sometimes prone to crack over time. Mm. So it's a bit of a risk, so I just left them there. Yeah, good call, I think. And they were pretty pricey as well. Ah, good call. Oh! Oh! I guess. Soaked. I'm um, soaked. Yeah, it's dripping off him. Let's <laughs> move to both. <laughs> Let's get out. <laughs> Here we are, we're now in Porth. In Porth. Hang on, look, spin the camera there. Every time you come here, you tell me there's parrots in there. I've never seen a parrot in there. No, nah, you probably got rid of them, that's why. But uh, what's this now? Round seven? Seven. Round seven. Round seven. Come on, let's do this. Just messed up the rounds, thought it was round seven. <laughs> it's round eight, actually. Round eight. You sure it's round eight? Shut up. Well, here we are, we're now in Porth. Yep, and what is eight. it? Round eight. You sure? Yeah. You literally just said seven earlier. Like, literally just then. Are you trying to mess up my videos or what? <laughs> Round eight. Get us to it. Come on. 
Here we are, a Ronda Animal Aid. Cool, I think I've loads of toys in. Oh. Rory the racing car. Let's see if he works. Needs new batteries. I'm gonna have a good run through this. Last time I went through it from PS1 games. <laughs> fluffy stuffies. It's not squish mama. Oh, I used to love Barbara. The Phantom. What if it's in good condition? The pages are clean. What year is this from? 1991. I'm gonna pick that up. Lots of stones. All the mixed bits. Oh, Toffee Hammer. I picked that up. I picked up a Toffee Hammer quite recently, so that'd be nice to bundle up. Spot another Toffee Hammer. Two. Around there, I just spotted that as well. The Darling Buds and Me. I just looked on CEX. I can only trade them for about 120, but still not bad. Bits and bobs. I don't think it's going to be much in here. Nope. I've got the car that the two hammers in the book. Well, that's not bad. I picked them bits for £2. And um, we're going to head to the last one, which is now. Round nine now, isn't Round it? nine, final round. Right. We're not doing bad so far, both of us. Here we are, guys, the last charity shop, the ten of us. Let's have a look. To the games. Oh, happy days. Another Pokemon find. Was he 199? What year is he from? I think he's one of them uh, Burger King ones. I can't see a year on it, but I'm still going to pick it up for 199. That's maybe one for the collection. Oh, I beat you into this. All the old Tom's Tank. Missing the... They're not in the best position. Let me see what I can fight fish out. I think I'm going to leave them for someone else. They're not in the best of condition. So, I'll leave them. Well, there you have it, guys. I had that... The Pikachu, um, I think it's the Burger King one, for one ninety nine. that's not bad. Ian's still in there looking around, he's trying to outdo me. <laughs> so me and Ian have just uh, finished our lunch. Good lunch. And, uh, yeah, so we had an amazing day. Hey, it's been an absolute class day. Really yeah, good day. definitely. <laughs> Both found some bits for the collection and to sell on eBay. It's been a good day. Yeah. So, guys, make sure to pop on to... Uh, Ian's channel, The Master yeah. of Pieces. Yes, check it out. So, yeah. So, we're now back in the Poker Cave, guys. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> what an amazing uh, trip with Ian. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant guy he is. So, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed our um, hunting. And uh, we had some amazing pickups. So, especially our gold chain. <laughs> Sorry, Ian. i got to bring that up again. <laughs> So yeah guys, if you enjoyed the video, but like I said before, make sure to jump onto Ian's channel, show him the love, show him the uh, support. So like always guys, make sure to leave a lucky like, make sure to uh, drop a comment down below what you thought about the pickups and the eBay sales. And like always, make sure to Thunder Punch, Bubble Beam, Rock Smash, Earthquake, <laughs> that subscribe button down below. I really boy Welsh Poke Picker. Keep on picking. Peace.